guys, not only is traffic bad, there's dinosaurs. <laughs> You know, they would have almost believed it if they didn't see your fingers. <laughs> hey, you gotta entertain yourself. You're in traffic. You never know what you'll see sitting in traffic. Like a little penguin just sitting around. Hi guys, how are you? Enjoying the sun? Okay. And I'm pretty sure people think we're idiots. Well, if that's the truth, let's see what Mr. Possum thinks. I think y'all are cool, guys. Ah, traffic's going, I gotta go. <laughs> You're an idiot. Oh, apparently. What? What? <laughs> interesting event. I recommend it if you like history. It's not what I would call fun. Yeah, I don't think quotes. I would uh, take children to it. I wouldn't waste the money on it. Yeah, kids are probably going to be bored there. Yes. But I thoroughly enjoyed it. Definitely seen a lot of Mustangs. Yes. Bang.
Eight pounds. Eighty-one. Eighty-one, man. That's hot. It's getting pretty warm. It's not humid today, though, so it's hot. It's a it's a good warm eighty-one, but here in a few months, even eighty-one will be miserable because Tennessee humidity is awful for anybody that's traveling to town. You get slapped with humidity pretty fast. And it's one of those sneaky things that gets a lot of people. They'll say, oh, it gets 90 and 95 where we live. But then when you come to Tennessee or anywhere in the south, and you get that uh, 90 and 95 degree and it's humid, it just sucks the life out of you. And it's, <laughs> it's dangerous. over there in the window with that CRV. Doesn't that look awesome? It's like it could have been washed. Oh, what about that? Now for anybody that hasn't been down here in a while, over to the right you will see a huge Sunliner Diner. That's new. Newish. How long has it been here? Four years? Three years? Oh, I was thinking like a year. Uh, you're bad at giving timelines. My timelines are bad, but I think it's been here at least two years. If you know the answer, comment below. Put your answer in the comments, guys, if you know. Yes. So I can prove my wife wrong. Settle the feud. I want to prove her wrong. Every chance I get. You usually don't. You usually don't. Over here on the left, we have the end of the Christmas place, which we stay there. Oh, nice. Very nice. Is that a CRP broken down? It is. Now, this is still technically the off season, so you will see some places doing maintenance, redecorating. What do you call that? Construction. So, uh, don't, uh, yeah, what she said. <laughs> Excuse our mess is what the sign said. <clears throat> and over here on the right, we have Paula Dean's Lumberjack View. That is not a dinner show. It's not? No. So you just can see lumberjacks? Yes, I don't know. Like there's no food involved. No food. You just watch lumberjacks. Interesting. Do you know what the price is on that? I do not. I haven't really looked into it. It sure would have been nice information for the viewers. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, viewers. We're assuming it may be cheaper than other shows down here since there's no dinner involved. Right. Now we are particular fans of Dixie Stampede. Yes. Or, I'm sorry, Dolly Stampede. Oh, yeah. Dolly Stampede. Um, do you remember what the price was? Like, no. I don't either now. But it, honestly, it's a must-see show. It's the best show down here, in yeah. my opinion. And highly recommend the Christmas show. Yeah. That's the only show we've been to at Dick Dolly Stampede, Dixie Stampede. Like three times though, but yes. Now we are at the Where's Valley Road at Red Light. 
you can turn right and go out to Townsend. Townsend. Where is Valley? That area. It'll also take you to Cades Cove or from that route. Or you can turn left and go over here to the track to do some go kart racing. Go kart racing. Put putting. Put putting. So they have a little arcade. And you can actually go on up through there where they have a new shopping center up in there now. You might be able to look at it. I don't know what the name of it is. That's a good question. Inquiring minds want to know. Yeah. But our mission is to get to Gatlinburg. But this is a, a busy day for traffic. Yeah, the mission is to get to Gallenberg to either do the Anakista uh, chairlifts or the Skybridge chairlifts. So one or the other, we're not sure. I think he just wants to see me terrified. Yeah, and we're not even 100% sure if we'll make it to Gallenberg because of traffic, but it's going pretty good. Now on the left here, we have the Pirates Voyage Dinner Show. That's off the Dolly Park. And then at this red light is the island road, which you will turn left to go to the island where Paula Dean Family Kitchen, the Margaritaville Hotel, hotel restaurant, and then the island itself. And there's a huge arcade in there that's really nice. Yeah. So we're just riding along, enjoying this day at 81 degrees. I don't see any rain in sight. However, it is calling for rain tomorrow. And it's some storms here in Pigeon Forge, Gatlinburg area. Oh wow, looks like they've built a big brand new holiday inn here on the left. Interesting. Well, that's an eyesore. It's not going to be nice though. Oh, I'm sure it's a brand new, uh, brand new hotel. Oh, with this Venice Barbecue here on the right. Venice Best barbecue. ribs in town. We have eight those. That might be the only ribs yeah. too. Now here is Hardy's on the right where we had our honeymoon dinner at. The yes, I think you would call that a honeymoon dinner. We eloped and came down here and got married and ate at Hardy's after yeah. we got married. Well, that Mad Dog Creamer is busy outside. Everybody even wants some ice cream on this hot day. Packed. Yes. All the picnic tables were packed. Were the stockings hung by the chimney with care? What? What? What are you even going with? What are you talking about? Here's one of these green suits. Oh, yeah. My favorite color. They're building something here on the rock. It's a huge building. That's a huge building. <laughs> it's weird. What's it say? It says Joseph Construction. Do you know what it's going to be? Comment below. We have Huck Finn's catfish here on the rock. That's delicious. If you like some seafood, get your fiddles. Vittles? What's that called? Vittles. Vittles. <laughs> V-I-T-T-L-E-S. Vittles. <laughs> Not fiddles <laughs> that you play. Oh, we missed that red light. where you go to the old mill district. Did I run it? I don't know. I wasn't paying attention. I was laughing over the fiddles and the vittles. Do not tell me if I ran that red light in the comments. I don't <laughs> Oh, look at that. They've got a bear as the entrance over there. Oh, I've never seen that one. I have either. seen the alligator and the shark down here, but never the bear. Porky's barbecue here on the right. Boy, that's delicious. That is very delicious. They have barbecued nachos at Corky's, and they are a must, must eat. Yes. This guy's filming us, and we're filming him. That's funny. This is going to be a long video. Yeah. Like put a new battery in before we go <laughs> on the, the chair lifts. Yep. 
up here on the right we have Denny's that's open 24 hours. Highly recommend Denny's Diner. Yeah, a lot of these restaurants down here are really good. That Texas Roadhouse, uh, that's not the one we ate at, is it? No, we ate at Logan's. Logan's down here is really good. All the Cracker Barrels are good. Yeah, this is the one we probably visit the most right here on the right. Now, one place I don't think we've ever been is this Kentucky Fried Chicken. Correction, we have. Have we? Yes. We have ate in there because they have it upstairs and we were going to eat up there and it was closed. We couldn't go upstairs. I remember being in the building. I just didn't remember eating. Uh -huh. But that's a double decker Kentucky Fried Chicken. Which is odd. They got a new big hotel over here. Yeah, that's cute. Country Inns and Suites. That's awesome. Yeah. I feel like we saw that last time. Now, of course, you probably can't see it, but up on the left is where the uh, new campground, Jimmy Buffett Margaritaville campground. 